Hello and welcome back everyone to our Magic the Gathering set explorations and in this episode we're finally going to be finishing? Yeah, we're finishing the uh, the, the Cartier block with Dragons of Tarkir. <laughs> there are dragons, there are, like, um, mm. um, wait, wait, where is it? This one, yeah, there's this one. Is, his, um, him, 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 him is a dragon lord. So there, aha. Uh -huh. Lords, the dragon right. lords. Um, I am going to be running uh, the Dramo the Dramoka Focus White Green. It, it, there's technically supposed to be a full shard here, but like Dramoka himself is only white green, and uh, I didn't like the uh, other part of the shard. So yeah, I'm just gonna be doing the white green stuff. Sweet. Whereas Cloud stuff. is running. I am running Colagans. Rakdos. Yes. Save me for a moment. He's got a lot of dash stuff. And dash is a really powerful keyword. Honestly, the Tarkir block introduces a bunch of different keywords. And although a lot of them are cool, very few of them are useful. Dash is honestly extremely useful, whereas mine is support. Support is not as good. It means that I'm trying to build a, a, a serious amount of smallish towers. Towers you could knock down, of course, with the flying, fire-breathing dragons. Well, that's the hope, at least. Yes. Right, are we ready to begin? Hell yeah, we're ready. Let us go. Mm. Roaring Rampage! Ha, uh, mm. <laughs> I got an 18. Alright, I'll four. choose to go first. Sweet. Yikes. Um, yeah, I, I think I'll actually keep this. Yeah. Ah, uh, shh. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'll, I'll I'll give it a shot. I I I can put something together here. Mm, all right then. I'm gonna start with an evolving wilds, and I'll crack it for a forest. Mm. And with that, uh, I will end. The evolving wilds, and this is the wild landscape of Tarkir. I have no one drops, so I'm gonna start with a swamp and end my turn. Okay then. I do have one drops. <laughs> I did not draw them. Hmm. All right. I'm gonna go into a plains and then, uh, I'm gonna spend two in order to cast the Herald of Dramoka, getting all of my warriors vigilance. All of my other warriors, rather. Because he himself has vigilance. Because yes. ordinarily, creatures that give abilities to creatures already have the creature the ability natively, so they do not have to grant it to themselves. Hmm. Interesting choice here. Okay, I'm gonna pay two, and I'm gonna dash out my reckless imp. Mm, all right then. When creatures are dashed, they gain haste, and they are returned from the battlefield to the hand at the end of the turn. Well, at the beginning of the next end step. I'm going to fly in you for two with haste. All right, I'll take two. Yes, you do. And I'm going to end my turn and return the Reckless Imp to my hand. All right, my move. The main stipulation is that abilities with sorcery speed cannot hit or, or affect uh, dashed out creatures. Hmm... There are All other right, stipulations, so, too. I am going to spend three mana in order to cast the Dramoka Captain. He has Vigilance. Mm, yes, not only does he have Vigilance, Actually, he, he does not, because he's not worried about one. <laughs> I All misspoke. Right. He does not actually have Vigilance. Go ahead. Swing it no, for two right. with Vigilance. A warrior. I take two damage from the Unblock Herald. All right, and I will end. There's so many different types of attacking units on the field. Soldiers, knights, warriors, imps, uh, ber berserkers. But why so many different? Are they not all united under the banner of I want to effing kill you? Hmm. Okay. Thinking now. I'm going to put down a swamp and thinking whether do I want to leave mana open or do the other thing. 
Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna dash into you again. Aha. Mm. Go With another reckless, reckless, reckless imp. imp. Okay. Or is it the same one? Mm. It's probably the same one, honestly. Nice. All right. Now you have taken the hit. I'm gonna end my turn and return the reckless imp to my hand. All right. My move. Mm. Ooh, that's nice. Do I want to do that though? I don't think so. At least not yet. Yeah, not yet. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna spend two in order to cast the Light Walker. Mm. Nice. And then I'm gonna swing at you for three. And when uh, and when Dramoka Captain attacks, I'm gonna activate Bolster One in order to put a one-one counter on my Light Walker. Nice. So I take three damage from your unblocked creatures. Yep, and I will end. Sweet Jesus! All right. Swing. Okay, so here comes the retaliation. I'm gonna pay two to cast defeat, destroy okay. target creature with power two or less. All right. Your Dramoka captain is now destroyed. Okay then. Oh, but that's not all. I'm going to put you in a predicament. I'm also going to cast the Self-Inflicted Wound. Ooh. Target opponent sacrifices a green or white creature of their choice. If that player does, they lose two life. Nah, I'm just going to take two. No, you must sacrifice a creature. Oh, okay. Um, hmm. Alright, I'll sacrifice my Herald of Dramonka. Interesting choice. I'm going to end my turn now. Okay, then. Mm. Oh, that is not the thing I, I did. I screwed up uh, uh, really early on. Oh, well. Uh, I'm going to put down my forest, and then I'm going to spend... It's, uh, yeah, it's only two, actually. I'm going to spend two in order to cast Avatar of the Resolute, who enters the battlefield with a 1-1 one -one counter, because I have a creature with a 1-1 one -one counter on him. Nice. Mm. And All right. I'm going to swing at you for three in the air. Yeah, I'm going to take that three, because I have no creatures that can block it. And, uh, I will end. Sweet. My turn. Drawing card. Hmm. I'm going to put down a swamp. I'm going to pay two to cast the ultimate price. Mm. Destroy target monocolored avatar of the resolute. Mm. Okay. Next, I'm going to pay three. To cast even more control magic. Culligan's Command. Okay. Choose two. I choose... Uh, check in graveyard real quick. I have no creature cards in my graveyard, so I can't choose that. So I choose... Deal two damage to any target. That's going to be two damage to your Light Walker. And... And because I have to choose it simultaneously, I'm also going to choose you. Target player discards a card. All right. In response, I'm going to spend two in order to cast Ramoka's Command. Uh-oh. Mm, I'm going to give my Light Walker a 1-1 one -one counter. And uh, I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to prevent all damage target instant or sorcery spell would deal this turn. Okay. So you still have to discard a card. Yep. Uh... I'm going to discard my Sunscorch Regent. Oh, that's a, that's a good one to get out of your hand. It's a very good one. Okay, so that's done. Uh, I am looking at a fucking mate in three right now, unless I can bring about your destruction. I'm going to end my turn now. Okay. Mm. Oof, damn. That is not what I wanted to see. I screwed up really bad turn one. Anyway, I'm going to swing at you for three uh, four in the air. There's a good chance that your early game mistakes will be forgiven by your eventual victory. So I take four damage. Mm, all right. And uh, I will end. Nice. Okay. Yoink. Swing. Ooh, okay. All right. Now we're cooking with gas. Except I can't do both in the same turn. God damn it. Um, I could do something, though. Yeah, that's a real problem right there. Um, I gotta count real quick. 
See, the thing is, is that time is just no longer on my side, really, because you can kill me in two turns, so I'm gonna make this as close as I can. Okay, cast five for the Berserker's Onslaught. Alright. Attacking creatures I control have double strike. Hmm. Especially attacking creatures that are dashed onto the battlefield. So you Which have very less nice. time to react to them. Yes. Ooh. Not the thing I wanted, but it'll help. Anyway, I'm gonna spend two to cast the Herald of Dromoka. Now my Lightwalker has Vigilance. Ha 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 ha. Damn. Mm. Swing at you with four in the air. Okay, so I'm down to four. And uh, I will end. Very good, sir. Very good. Okay, so about that whole attacking creatures I control have double strike thing. Here we go. Uh, let's put down a mountain. Uh, I am going to pay two. I'm going to dash out my legendary Zergo Bell Striker. Okay. Why is he legendary? Fuck you, that's why. His brother, Zergo Helm Smasher, is way more interesting. I'm also going to pay two in order to dash out the Reckless Imp. Okay. Now going into my attacking step with my super awesome creatures with haste into a suicide bombing attack that will most certainly fail. I'm going to attack you for two on the ground and two on the air, both with double strike. Alright, I'm going to have Herald of Dramaka Black Zergo Bell Striker. Okay. Now, going to the damage resolution step. One, Double two, strike four. is going to destroy your Herald of Dromoka. And then you take four damage from my unblocked 2-2 two, two with Double Strike. Yes. Awesome. Okay. At the end of the turn, both of these creatures were dashed out. Both of these creatures get return of my hand, making this a 10-point game. Mm. All right. My move. Unless, unless, of course, you can gain life during this turn in order to widen the margin of victory. I cannot. I didn't... My my uh, turn one screw-up really bit me in the ass. Alright. Gonna swing at you for four in the air. Yep. And I lose, because I'm out of life points. Good game. Mm-hmm. GG. Alright. On, on to round two. 